You'll know we love a success story at MTD CNC. Today I'm in Cambridgeshire at Velocity Precision. This business was founded on the 1st of December 2012. They bought their first machine tool off of eBay. Since then, in the last four years, they've bought five brand new Haas machine tools. I'm going to go inside and have a chat with Glenn about this business and what they like about Haas. So, Glenn, it's been some journey for you over the last five years. And obviously part of that journey has been the Haas machines that we've got. This is your latest one, the ST30. Why did you buy this? That's correct, yeah. Um, we, wanted, we needed to uh, increase our compatibility of our turning. Uh, we only had the one at the time. Um, and this model came with uh, the tool eye and the parts catcher. Um, because this is a straight two axis lathe for you here, isn't it? That's correct, yes. And, and we often find when people buy machines these days, everybody's talking about sophistication, multi-axis, y-axis, sub-spindle. That's not the case for you guys. No, we're pro, uh, purely prototyping. So what we found is that we wanted the flex flexibility of moving on to the milling machines um, and not having the milling facilities on this one here. So you do your, your turning here and you're milling on milling machines? That's correct, yes, yeah. Now let's talk about that because your milling machines are obviously Haas as well. I, I sort of preempted this video with the, the fact that you've bought so many machines over the past four years. What are the machines you've bought other than this ST30? Uh, well, we currently we've got two mini mills. Uh, we've got a VF2 super speed and a VF4 super speed. And tell me about the super speed machines. Are they as are they super speed? Do they give you? Do they make parts faster for you? Yes. In one word, yes. Um, they've got double the spindle speed of the mini mills. They move faster, um, and obviously, predominantly, we're aluminiums, uh, and we can hit the material a lot faster and harder, and obviously, make parts quicker. You talk about hitting material hard and fast. How many hours are you? machine in a day here Glenn. Are you working weekends? Are you, are you double shifting? Uh, we do. We start anywhere between 6 and 6.30 in the morning and we go through until usually 6 but it could be 8, 9, 10 o'clock um, and Saturday all day. And is that all part of the growth of a company like yours? You've been, you've been going four or five years now. Where are you going to be in four or five years time? Hopefully sat on a beach. <laughs> no, um, no. Yes, basically um, we, we knew that this was going to be a five year project to get the, the company up and running, uh, get it to a stage where we can employ some quality skilled staff that can run the business for myself and James. And from there, we can then start to look at the business and grow it further from, from that point onwards. Now you're a precision machining business. Are you making precision components? Yes, we are. Yes, lots of precision components, yes. And in what type of market sectors and fields? Um, we uh, obviously, right on the edge of Cambridge, uh, we do a lot of medical scientific, uh, digital inkjet printing is a big business for us, so yeah, quite a few. And what attracted you to the Haas machines to start with when the company was founded? I mentioned that you bought your first one from eBay. Is that the reason you went on to more Haas's because that was the first machine that you bought? No, not at all. Um, the interface, the user interface is so easy to pick up. Um, and obviously the second for us was the service support that you get with the machine. Um, they're pretty much here within 24, 48 hours. And if not, there's always a service engineer that you can speak to on the phone to try and help you out if you are down. And you're a team of young guys here. Do you take on apprentices as well? That's something that we're looking to in the future, yeah. Um, in previous jobs, I have taken on apprentices and trained them up to the way that I want stuff to be made and machined. Um, but like I said, we need to get to that five-year plan, uh, make sure the business is running, and then we'll look for apprenticeships after that. It's two things, Glenn. It's a great advert for UK manufacturing, but a great advert for Haas as well. So thanks for your time. Thank you very much.